All right, now we're doing 7Q, the highest profit wins. This is by Bikeas, and 87% of people like it. Ben has a very simple idea to make some profit. He buys something and sells it again. Of course, this wouldn't give him any profit at all if he was simply to buy and sell it at the same price. Instead, he's going to buy it for the lowest possible price and sell it at the highest. Write a function that returns both the minimum and maximum number of the given list or array. All right. So out of these, minimum one, max five. Out of this, minimum five, max this. Uh, and then one, 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 one. There we go. Uh, all arrays or lists will always have at least one element, so you don't need to check the length. Also, your function will always get an, an array or list, and we don't have to check for null, uh, undefined, or similar. Well, that's good, because that's always usually a pain. All right, so first things first, we're going to check out uh, max and min. So math.min. Whoa, whoa, whoa math.min and uh, basically you just put a bunch of numbers into this thing uh, common separated values and it'll say the maximum excuse me the minimum of whatever that is same thing with math.max uh, and so we're going to do that right now on this side we're going to put the math.min we're going to say math.min r and then on this side we're going to say math.max r all right, let's see if this works. Test it out. Uh-oh. Nan, what's the problem? What's going in here? Why doesn't it look like what we're looking for? Uh, it's because right here, there's an array in here, right? It's R. And what did this say it wanted? Comma separated values. So we got to turn this array into comma separated values, all right? Hello, spread syntax. Do you allow an iterable such as an array or string to be expanded in places where zero or more arguments or elements are expected? I think you do. And so we're just going to go like this. We're going to say dot, 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 uh, dot, dot, dot. And now we've got this. Maybe it'll work. And it did. Awesome. Attempt it. There we go. Submit it. Very much like this one. Uh, looks pretty similar to that, doesn't it? Uh, let's go to mine. Looks pretty similar to this one too. Cool. Uh, best practice on this one, and we'll see you next time.